Hi friends, this is Prithvi. Welcome to Techie Taiki. Today I will be installing Libra Lake version 8.95.1 beta on Raspberry Pi. Libra Lake version 8.95.1 beta finally arrived with improved stability and new hardware support. I wanted to install this and try this one because more importantly uh, I wanted to try Amazon Prime and Netflix on it. Kodi now unofficially steams content from services like Netflix and Amazon and I wanted to try that out. So I will download uh, the image for Raspberry Pi 0W from from the site and flash it on the SD card. Raspberry Pi 0W is an awesome little bit device, uh, compact and the Wi-Fi works really great on it. I have previously made videos on Liber Lake earlier and uh, I have also shown how uh, how it plays content online. So I'm downloading the image now. We'll flash the image on the SD card and then and I will show you the boot screen. Please stay tuned. So just wanted to show you that I'm flashing the beta version only, version 8.95.1. I'm done with flashing the image and Libre Lake is booting for the first time. So as I said in the beginning of this video, I will be installing Netflix and Amazon Prime video on demand. So please stay tuned. Now it's time to install Netflix and Amazon Prime. From the left hand side menu go to add on and click install from repository. Go to library like add ons and click on video adaptive input stream. There you will get one option. The first option input stream adaptive. We have to install that. So once this is done, we'll again go back to install from repository. Going back to install from repository option. So we'll click on all repositories. Again, we click on add on repository and we'll get this Kodi nerds add add ons 
will install this once this is done we'll open it and uh, netflix option is already there we'll go ahead and install this add-on as well Now we'll go to Sandman 79 repository. From here we will get Amazon Video On Demand. Netflix is already done. So we'll go ahead and install this add-on as well. We'll go back to all repository again and from there from Sandman 79 we'll update it then open it we'll go to video add-ons and from here we'll we'll install amazon prime video video on demand So we'll go to add-ons we can see Amazon and Netflix both are installed successfully now once you click on Netflix it will either Netflix or Amazon it will ask for your email user ID and password you enter it and start using the services I'm not doing it due to uh, copyright claim I will not be streaming any videos from here but you can go ahead and do it so YouTube add-on I have installed earlier only before even adding Netflix and Amazon Prime but I'm not playing any videos from here don't want to get into any copyright claim so all the popular videos everything is there So the only thing which I can do, I can search my own channel and stream one video from there just to show you the stream quality. So I'm searching my own channel only from YouTube search. Hi friends, this is Prithvi. Welcome to Techie Taiki. I wanted to buy Asus Thinkerboard for quite some time now and I have one now. 2017. But at In terms of size, both Asus Thinkerboard and Raspberry Pi 3 and 3B Plus are same in size. I'll just put Orange Pi PC here so orange pi pc is also same in size 
but the only difference is Asus Thinkerboard Raspberry Pi 3 3B Plus in terms of Ethernet port. That's it from that's it from my side, guys, from this video. Hope you have liked this video, and if you have liked, please like, share, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.